I'm going to go prune my blackberry plants. Now I'm not pruning them. This is not just a, uh, a typical uh, spring pruning. This is to clear the walkway. Some of them have fallen over uh, a little bit. I let them get too tall and uh, they're just too bushy and they're out in the walkways and it's going to be difficult for people to to come in and pick. So, uh, and it's, I can't get in there. Some of the rows I can't get in there uh, right now to even mow. So, uh, I've rigged up a little little thing here. I'm going to be using, for the most part, going to be using this uh, these hedge trimmers. They're electric. They're 110 volt electric. So I have uh, an inverter, that uh, Duracell 800 watt inverter. I've shown you that before. And I've got, uh, for the bigger pieces, and there are going to be some way bigger than, than my thumb, uh, I, I took uh, three different sets of pruners out here. I don't think I'm going to need the big ones, but the, all, all these are Fiskars, and um, I really like Fiskars. But what I'm doing, I've made a little mobile um, cutting unit where I'm going to be able to drive through, and I've hooked up the inverter to uh, two places on my golf cart. That is the positive side of battery number one, that is the negative side of battery number two. First of all, I ran a voltmeter across of it to, across it to make sure it was the 12 volt side. If I use this side, which is that's positive, that's negative, I get 36 volts because of the way this is wired. Six, uh, six volt batteries makes 36 volt. But if you come over on this side, uh, these two batteries hooked together make 12 volts. And it's where they've got the lights uh, wired up. Uh, I don't think you can see that light. Looks like a cigarette lighter, but the light switch there. It's where they came off of it with this wire here and this black wire here for the lights. So the lights run off 12 volts and not 36. So that's what I'm doing here. Using uh, 12 volts to run my 12 volt by 120 volt, 12 volt DC to 120 volt AC inverter. So that's what we're doing here. We'll take it out there and I'll uh, start trimming up with the, um, mainly with the hedge cr clippers because that just makes it so much easier. And um, I'll do some with the, with the uh, pruners also. Let's get to it. But I got it done, and again, I wasn't, I wasn't uh, pruning for growth or anything like that. I was pruning strictly to get the walkways a little bit more manageable. I let them get away last year. I, I didn't prune my uh, canes. Uh, some of them I didn't prune to about four feet, which is what I've told y'all to do. So. Um, not necessarily practicing what I preach, but I got a bunch of them, and that's another thing. Uh, you know, I would have just gone out there with a pair of, um, you know, just a pair of pruners or something like that if, if it had been 10 or 15 feet uh, of blackberries. But I had 700 feet of blackberries, and I want to be able to drive through there, and I want to be able to mow through there. So, uh, so that's what we did. So now I'm gonna go mow so it. So that looks a whole lot better, and. Uh, got it mowed, trimmed. Almost kind of looks like a hedge, but it was uh, terribly overgrown. And uh, by the way, they are just full of green berries again. That's it. We're going to go. I got other stuff to do. We're going.